Alright. I don't really see anybody. But he sees my sniper scope, so don't worry. There's really no point in me actually coming out. Uh, so basically, I'm just uh, I'm useless. So basically, all I can do is just pop my head out for just a second and uh, and then hope I hit someone. I'm just firing there because I saw a sniper was there. All right, well, I guess we'll run across. All right, we got this objective. That's kind of nice. So, Prisley, what kit what kits are you equipping right now? I guess what's what's the flavor of the month for you? Right now, rocket. Yeah. Anything with an RPG is pretty good, right? Oh, your primary. What do you have your primary as? Uh, your your weapon. I don't have many unlocks except for the recon kit, unfortunately. There's a guy shooting over there. Because I really want to get a. Map. But shotgun's pretty fun. Really finicky. It's hard to actually get it to kill people. Unless you're right in their face, and sometimes even then it doesn't work out too well. Yeah, that's that's what I hate. It's it's they've put on the sniper projectile system, and the, the sniper projectile system, as it suck, it sucks in this game. So what do they expect it to, to have to do with shotguns? I hit that guy. Rocket around the corner. Oh, behind. Oh, there's so much rocket spam. That's also been enhanced in this game. Oh, by the way, I use I use flak specialization because all of them suck, and since there's so many explosives, you might as well. Even if I'm a damn recon, doesn't matter. It saves me half the time. Okay, let's go out of here. There's guys behind. No, I know. I'm just asking to get killed. And over here, I think there's like three people. Yeah, there's like no way we're getting through there. Oh, well, look, A is being taken. We're right beside A, and it got taken. It's you. Know, it's because there's like a tank right beside it. There's about three guys just camping in one of the bazaar stalls. Yeah, I see it. I'm getting them all. I think I got them all. I think it's everybody. Assuming we got the other thing, we're gonna lose anyways. At this point. Look at that, look at that, look at us. 94. I was hoping to actually get vehicle action in, but we didn't. But we, we got some nice sniper action in, so... I think that's good enough. Yeah, let's try and do a sniper flank, just, just for the fun of it. I don't really want to go where all these other people are. I'm not really deploying my toys a whole lot. I I, I usually do a lot a lot more. Here, let's put this thing in here. Uh, uh, really, no point in having that there. So the best way is to pretty much like play like TF2 sniper. And just, just charge around corners, I guess. I think it's the only way they could give Sniper possibly more. Is is adding that TF2 charge mechanic. Poor arrow. up here. Oh good, that's our that's our vehicle, thank god. Oh shit. No, nope, I was behind something, but don't worry, I'll get sprayed down. And this guy is probably on the other side of the street, but that won't matter. That's what I mean, four grip suppressor. I, I don't understand why that's like the flavor of the month for everybody. I guess it's just the spread reduction. I guess so. And oh look, I, I could use this one. Oh wait, wait, this is being taken? 
Is it? Why is it blinking? Okay, I guess not. You know, I saw someone in that other place. Like, oh, he's like over here in the street, so... I guess he's not there anymore. Can we take that point? Well, I don't see much of a point in taking all these things, but you know. Oh yeah, I have the Rex pistol. Maybe I'll use that. There we go. Let's give this a try. But you ain't gonna win at machi against machine guns. I guess it was a slightly longer range, but you know. I don't win against machine guns anyways at close range, so I don't know why I bother. <laughs> the only way to play is to just be a pussy bitch, I guess. Wait, how do we lose all our points? Is this mine? No, it's not. Spotted a hostile jeep. Over. Enemy soldier has been spotted. Yeah, I wasn't meant to win that. That's what I mean. Even if I had hit him, uh, well, I, I would have had to hit him and then get the pistol shot off, but already as it is, I had a huge advantage because he wasn't shooting at me, but it doesn't matter. You're going to lose anyways. So I find it to be r kind of irritating. And I can't shoot those through, through those windows ever. There's a guy driving that, but it doesn't matter. I've, I've shot someone out of a helicopter before. When he was standing completely still, mind you, but, you know. It was still one of the more amusing moments I've had in this game as a recon. Wait, wait, did we actually take that vehicle out? I think we're working on it. Still up there. Yeah, something's shooting at me, I don't even know. It's probably this, that fucking guy with the- oh no, it's the tank. It's the- uh, I'm gonna take your kit. Oh, never mind. We just died immediately. <laughs> so, um... I don't, I don't know. You see, like, a 15-6? Um, I did better than most people on this team, but um, since I was playing Recon, I, I wasn't meant to, to be anywhere on the scoreboard. So, basically my recommendation is you, you can buy this game if you're if you're all into assault rifles on that. You're gonna you're gonna have a lot of fun with it. Um stay the hell away from Team Deathmatch unless you're uh you're you're really into bad spawns and Call of Duty kind of gameplay. I got all these ribbons and for some reason I still like I'm not even on the scoreboard right now. I have to scroll down to see myself. Like is this not ridiculous to you? I have I have the highest the highest uh kills on this team. Uh, well, like, next to this guy, who's probably Recon too. <laughs> like, why? Why am I down here? Why? What am I missing 2,000 points for? What What was this good guy doing? He, he died more, way more than I did. That's the automatic penalty for going Recon, negative 2,000. Yeah, that's, it's pretty much, that's it. They're just going, like, don't fucking play Recon if you want it, you want it. it yeah, that, you know what, that, that, that pisses me off, because it, it took a while to actually get the last sniper rifle. That's, that's why they do that. I don't know if we're gonna do another game. Depends on the map. I wanted to do some tank action. If we don't get the tank, I'm gonna I'm just gonna leave it off. Oh fuck this! I'm not doing this again. Uh, so you know, as I said, um, if you like assault rifles, um, you know you're gonna love this game. Um, basically, let me see what all the other guns I got. Oh, let me show you actually the menu here. Uh, so basically, you have appearance. This never saves. I have never had this save. So if you want to choose your appearance, you gotta choose it every fucking time, and. This is the reason why this is such a console port. It's because I have to scroll through every single fucking option. They couldn't just have a list here. What the fuck? Honestly. <laughs> and uh, what else? Um, and yeah, the same as the, with the, the the guns. Like they have it. Like they have like a quick quick switch here. Let me show you that. They have like a quick switch. I can go. Okay, I want the PP two thousand. Oh yeah, as a recon. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do much better with that. But you know, so I, I equip that, and it's like, um, you know. Well, I can't choose my add-ons. Where do I have to go? I have to go into the, the friggin' loadout menu here. And look, it's once again, I have to scroll through crap. Well, I don't I, I don't have anything for this gun, because I, of course, wouldn't use it. Um, and it, like, does this little fuzz effect and everything. So I'm like, okay, I want the I want the 12x, you know. Like, some of these guns you have a lot of, and, and so it's going to take forever for you to scroll through them. Um, in this case, I, I don't have much for this gun, but let me let me go to the SV98 one second. I have I have everything for that. I even have, like, 500 kills for that. Look at all this shit I have for it. 
If I, if I want to get the ACOG yeah, right there and straight pull and that, that stuff. This is, by the way, this is like the much inferior rifle to the other one because it has so much bullet drop. Like there's like a billion pistols too. You gotta scroll through them. Do you know why you have to scroll through them? Guess what? <laughs> Guess what? It's a console interface. Uh, it's 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 pretty terrible. I I don't know. And like there there are actual video options, fortunately enough. Like you get controls and stuff. I have it on medium just so it runs a little faster. Oh, they have actual field of view. Uh, this is pretty much I think all this is here basically because uh they started by making a PC game but then midway through they had to they had to change it. So I don't know. You know, uh, I I reckon I highly recommend this game if you have a friend to play with and if he uh if he plays in vehicles with you cuz as I said like or or if you play a lot of assault, you know. That that's basically the only two instances. I don't. I don't really find it that worth it. Otherwise, I. I. I don't completely regret getting this, but it definitely misses the magic of what um, buying a, a a good game used to be like. Uh, at least for me, I, I haven't felt that. Actually, I think it was Portal Two is the only game, uh, and D D Human Revolution. Those are the two games I really felt were really good this year. So, I don't know. That's that's. I guess my review for Battlefield Three. Any closing thoughts, briefly? This game definitely doesn't feel like it's seventy dollars worth. You be, you paid seventy dollars for this? It's like fifty nine or sixty nine. One of the. Uh, I think that's what it is. Now. Although they give you a free poster now whenever you buy it. That that must have been like the collector's edition or some shit. I paid I paid I paid about fifty three for this. All right, Origin definitely not worth it. I'm not I'm not I'm not paying for anything else on Origin. I actually didn't I didn't pay for anything on Origin. I used Direct to Drive. And I'm just talking with with this loading screen, sure. You wanna say anything else, Priestley? I'm just gonna hang around this vehicle. <laughs> nope. Nah, I like it. Yeah, it's, you know, it, uh, it wasn't... As I say, it's not the worst purchase I've made. I think the worst, worst purchase I've made this year is Rage, because I couldn't even get that to fucking run. On, on a very modern... It probably runs now, but... I still was really pissed off about that and couldn't get a refund. I think that's basically it, though. All right. Uh, well, I hope you guys. It still looks good. Oh yeah, it looks amazing. Um, despite the fact single player is garbage and co-op is okay. Oh, I have this thing. I I shouldn't have went one against that guy. He must have been missing all all of his assault assault rifle sprays. I don't know, I guess we can do SV-98 now. I guess I'm not quite ending it. Enemy you know, I'm still doing fairly well. I don't know why I'm going to cut it off now. I guess, despite the fact I'm doing well, I'm just not finding much enjoyment in it. Oh, I was going to go up to the Humvee, but he shot me, so... I just want to shoot the window. I, I, I'm pretty sure you can't do that. Oh wow, I'm 3 to 1 already. Yeah, I think we're just gonna end it off here. Look, you got some bolt action, sniper action again. I don't think there's any other guns that are interesting. No, I, I've already done it all, so. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I shall see you later. Bye. You wanna say bye, Priestley? <laughs> Boy. Just a little something I want to add to the end of the video, because I have a feeling that the uh, my 15 to 6 score was going to um, pique the interest of a couple of commenters and they were going to show their own theories. So I figured I would actually um, show you guys the, the battle log for this, since we have this wonderful feature. Now, I'm not sure why, who the hell is Red Fox and why does he have so much um, points, oh, well, accuracy. That seems kind of odd. I guess he just joined? Because that's that's rather suspicious. I'm trying to look for him. Red Fox. Oh, he died a lot. Oh, he was, using, he was just using the RPG. That's why. Anyways, um. So basically, here's the match, fifteen to six. I wasn't actually the best recon. Uh, the best recon was some guy on my team named Magic Man who had fourteen kills, eighteen deaths. Died way more than I did. So I'm guessing he was just running towards the front line all the time. But if I actually go look at it, his uh, his score, he had two kill assists, um, 14 kills. He was using the M39, and it also got a couple pistol kills. Um, I'm not exactly sure how this is added up, his recon score. I guess it's like general score with 
team score with possibly... I, I don't know how this is calculated, why he got that much. Oh, it's bonus score plus that. I know that award score doesn't count towards it, so um, if he was capping objectives, for example, the flags wouldn't cap capture. I think that's bonus. I'm not sure. But anyways, um, so that's, that's basically the score right here, and if you look through... So he's like a t level 27, blah, 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 and he's got like a squad beacon. So he had, I guess he had a lot of people, um, uh, it's a squad spawn, spawn, by the way. So he, people were spawning on him rather than his beacon. I think there's a separate one for that. And he got some handgun kills. He finished a conquest round, got kills with snipers, and got five headshots, which is pr probably similar to what I got. Um, so if I show you here, uh, I had... Uh, let's see here. I had no assists, assists though, so everyone I saw, I, pre I pretty much killed outright. This guy had two assists. Okay, so he maybe got some suppression bonuses as well. Um, not as much bonus score, but you know, I can go... I, I, I got actually the same thing, so people were spawning on me. Uh, I got actually a lot of flight defense, but uh, he didn't get that at all. I actually have more uh, ribbons than he does, way more. So it it's beyond me uh, what he was doing differently. Maybe... I, I don't know. Maybe the thing though was I wasn't using my um, s the the radio beacon and the and the um, the motion sensor a lot, which I will admit. But I don't think the score would make a 600 point difference, like you see right here. So I'm I'm not too sure what's going on. But um, the times uh, I did find that you know. Um, I, I was spotting people most of the time, so the radio be beacon would have been uh, sorry the uh, the motion sensor would have been kind of mute either uh, mute any uh, either way because it's just like I'm spotting them anyways. You notice like I press Q, I, I do this by habit from Bad Company too. I just press Q the minute I see somebody. So if I die, someone else kills them. I get a spot assist and possibly kill assist. But um, we uh, I, I I don't know what the difference here was because I had a I had to kill more and I certainly didn't die as much, um, so I don't know what he was doing differently. But then we can go up to here. Um, also with the radio beacon, I I didn't really see I I didn't put it down a whole lot and I don't think that would have made the difference either. Um, you know I normally put it down a lot more. I'm not sure why I wasn't doing it too much there. So this guy was an engineer and so he killed one he killed a vehicle. Um, he got a bunch of kills a deaths. Uh, a bunch of dust too, but you know he did relatively well. Um, and he got like uh, he got three streak bonuses. Um, killed some people with carbines. Did some flag defense. Um, finished conquest. Here's the thing: I don't think our entire team was capping anything, so I don't think that's really uh, a factor of why we lost, because they had a lot of points, which means we weren't capping a lot. Um, so I don't think any of these people got high points because they were capping. Maybe this guy did. Get five revives. Yeah, this guy was reviving people the entire time, which is, explains his his uh, his score. Um, and that's pretty much it. And so uh, at this point, you know, you could say a bunch of things like, "Oh, why wasn't I capping more points?" Well, you know, uh, I tend to die a lot when I go out in the open and towards points, and um, and there was a couple times which I did, and I died pretty much immediately because people are just going to snipe you out with with their assault guns. So um, I was trying to play, hence the name recon. I was trying to uh, point out things like the tanks and the people, but I was also defending flags at the same same time and sniping them out. So. Um, I'm sure some people are going to give me advice on how uh, how to up that, but you know what? To be honest, um, I don't think there is a way you can up that. Uh, I that was a really well good round for me. Uh, 15 kills, six deaths. That means I was doing a fairly good job, um, and I was defending a lot too. So even though I wasn't capping, uh, technically for recon, uh, defending is probably the the best thing you can do. Um, Capping, you're just going to die because people spawn all around the point and they they just pretty much kill you because you don't have because assault rifles gun you down at basically every range. Um, so, like honestly, I think I I for the most part I played the class the way it was meant to be played, and that's all I could do. Um, which I I honestly find to be kind of ridiculous. I would have been I would have expected to be in the top five, um, but instead I'm I'm way out. I'm I'm two thousand points down from these people. So. You know, and they probably got most of their points from either repairing vehicles or something. Which, you know, they are completely, uh, you know, you, you, you do get a lot of points for doing vehicles. I, I do vehicles all the time and I get tons of points for that, doing that. But um, 
and most of the time I'll top the scoreboard, but I can never top the scoreboard as a recon, let alone I am 15th place right now on it, on, on this team, and the people below me like are not doing much better. What's this guy? He's probably a... Well, no, he's got a carbine, so I'm not sure what, what he, his deal was. I guess he wasn't tossing down his health pack or whatever he was playing, uh, which, which you know, usually explains a lot. Because you get, you get a ton of points for, just for healing people and stuff, which, you know, why is there such a point discrepancy, you know? Like, are they really helping the team more than I am? I, I don't know. Um, I'm finding that to be greater and greater, and Battlefield 2 really wasn't like this. Um, I found that to be much more uh, fair in this regard, so... Uh, it's I, I'm guessing it's just their way of saying don't play recon, and uh, I can't blame I can't blame them to be honest. It's, that's that's pretty much been the focus. It's um, it, it's it's basically cater it's ba basically pandering to uh the Call of Duty assault rifle audience because they hate being killed by one shot things like uh uh shotguns and sniper rifles, but they're but they love assault rifles. They love spraying assault rifles, and that's pretty much what this is what this entire game seems to be pandering to. It's just that kind of mentality, um, and I've noticed. I, I, I honestly, I played Call of Duty. I'm sick of assault rifles, so this is why I pretty much said the only way I have fun in playing this game is really uh, if I find a vehicle to go in. I don't. E I don't even leave the spawn until I get a vehicle. At sometimes, because uh, I just I I don't find if because this is what happens when you play infantry uh, with recon. It's just you you become either me or this guy who's still still in eighth place, despite being probably one of the biggest contributors. Like I wouldn't expect to beat this guy, but maybe this maybe these people, I don't know why they have four thousand points, so that's basically my feedback with that. So yeah, that's uh basically all I have to say. So uh have a good one guys.